man. 15 minutes for Pud. Warm chocolate and walnut brownies with a salted caramel sauce. Ooh, I'm glad I've left room. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to set. Oh, my God. <laughs> the walnuts didn't go in. Oh. Problem is, you've got no biny agent. So you've got this volcanic mixture of chocolate. Are the nuts crunched up when yeah, you put they're, them they're, in? I did it all, I just forgot to put, put them, them in. Put them in, mix it through. There you go, look what's happening. I quite it's feel silly. like crying right now. Don't cry. I won't cry. So anything else that was supposed to go in there? No. You sure? No. Right, stick it back in the oven. We want that to be sticky and sticky to the roots Ooh, of our mouths. Yes. And, and we don't want it to be dry or burnt. <laughs> now it's just like some liquid mess. Have you got any straws? <laughs> I'm not helping, am I? No, not at all. <laughs> I love that you guys are still trying to be positive about this. We have a brownie with a salted caramel sauce, and it's a healthier version of a traditional chocolate brownie. So there's no dairy in there. Wow. Um, and also, it's used in, with coconut sugar and coconut oil, so oh, wow. rather than refined sugars and stuff. That is absolutely sticking to my teeth. The brownie should be spongy, light, delicious. That is, unfortunately, it's burnt. It's like a chewy toffee. Oh, Marcus, I'm so sorry, but it's not... It's not work, really, has it? It's not a chocolate brownie. It's a hockey puck. That's horrendous. Right now, I feel a bit like a lost boy. Everything went wrong, so... <laughs> I feel like this is kind of like the one that you have to nail, and I didn't nail it.